Hurricane Ian was a, a very big storm. It came on land as a category four, almost a category five. Large wind damage and large water damage. The NDR team's mission is to recover the AT&T network and provide service to customers and first responders on the ground. So we're in Lehigh Acres, just outside of Fort Myers, Florida. Anytime there's a big storm, we run into issues with road closures due to flooding. During this storm, the causeway going over to Sanibel Island actually got washed away. We have an amphibious vehicle in the NDR fleet and we deployed equipment and people over to the island to do survey assessments, but also to turn up service using one of our CRDs, our Compact Rapid Deployables. Sanibel and Pine Island are perfect use cases for a CRD. We couldn't get a traditional SAT Colt over to the island because there's no roadways for us to access it. But with the amphibious vehicle, we loaded it on the back, we took the amphib three miles over to the island, and then deployed it very quickly to support the search and rescue folks on the ground. The amphibious vehicle, the idea when we purchased it was it could traverse multiple terrains, it could bring crews, it could bring personnel, it could bring equipment. And so this is exactly what we bought it for, but this is the first time we've used it uh, this much for this exact type of mission. So we were able to get a CRD over to turn up to support search and rescue. We were able to get people over there to do assessments on towers. We're bringing some logistical supplies. So it's, it's become really, really handy on this particular deployment. It's really rewarding when we come into areas like this and you see people who are so hard hit after these storms and you make a direct impact on trying to help them recover. So I think people are willing to do just about whatever it takes to help people. To learn more about AT&T, subscribe to this channel, visit the AT&T Newsroom, or watch more videos in the playlist seen here.